Hello everyone, you are welcome to how to solve this very nice radical equation. 4 minus x squared is equal to square root of 4 minus x. We need to find all possible values of x. Since this expression 4 minus x is under square root, so 4 minus x must be greater than or equal to 0. And if you move this negative x to the right hand side, then 4 must be greater than or equal to x. It means x must be less than or equal to 4. In this expression 4 minus x squared, 4 minus x squared must be greater than or equal to 0. If you move this negative x squared to the right hand side, then this will become 4 must be greater than or equal to x squared. It means uh, x squared must be less than or equal to 4. So, we have two conditions uh, as a domain of this equation we use to check the solutions of uh, this equation. First one is uh, x must be less than or equal to 4 and the second one is x squared must be less than or equal to 4. Now, let us continue by squaring both sides. We have the equation 4 minus x squared, we take square on the left hand side is equal to square root of 4 minus x and we take square on the right hand side. This uh, 4 minus x squared will become 4 squared minus 2 times 4 times x squared plus x squared whole squared is equal to this uh, square will be cancelled with the square root the, at right hand side we are left with 4 minus x. Now, we move these two terms uh, to the left hand side 4 squared minus uh, 2 times 4 will become 8 times x squared. We move this uh, plus 4 to the left hand side it will become negative 4 plus uh, this x squared whole squared will become x to the power 4 and this negative x will become plus x at the left hand side is equal to 0. Now, we can write this uh, 4 squared as uh, 1 time 4 squared and from these two terms uh, we can factor out negative 4 negative in bracket left uh, 2 x squared plus 1 4 as common plus uh, these two terms uh, x to the power 4 plus uh, x is equal to 0. Now, this is a quadratic equation in terms of uh, 4 where this one is as a this negative times uh, 2 x squared plus 1 is as b and this uh, x to the power 4 plus x is as c and uh, according to quadratic formula 4 is equal to value of p is negative times uh, value of p is negative 2 x squared plus 1 plus or minus square root of in place of b squared we write uh, negative times uh, 2 x squared plus 1 whole squared minus 4 times in place of a we write 1 times in place of c we write uh, x to the power 4 plus uh, x divided by 2 times in place of a we write 1. Next 4 is equal to this negative times negative will become positive 2 x squared plus 1 plus minus square root of since the square of a negative number is always positive. So, we ignore this negative sign and we take square of this uh, 2 x squared plus 1. 2 x squared plus 1 whole squared will become 
फोर एक्स टू द पावर फोर प्लस फोर एक्स स्क्वेड प्लस वन दिस नेगेटिव फोर टाइम्स वन टाइम्स एक्स टू द पावर फोर नेगेटिव फोर एक्स टू द पावर फोर नेगेटिव फोर टाइम्स वन टाइम्स प्लस एक्स विल बिकम नेगेटिव फोर एक्स डिवाइडेड बाय दिस टू टाइम्स वन टू एक्स फोर इज इक्वल टू टू एक्स स्क्वेड प्लस वन प्लस माइनस स्क्वेर ऑफ दिस पॉजिटिव फोर एक्स टू द पावर फोर विल बी कैंसल्ड आउट विद दिस नेगेटिव फोर एक्स टू द पावर फोर एंड हेयर वी आर लेफ्ट विद दिस फोर एक्स स्क्वेड फोर एक्स स्क्वेड दिस नेगेटिव फोर एक्स नेगेटिव फोर एक्स एंड दिस प्लस वन प्लस वन डिवाइडेड बाय टू नेक्स्ट फोर इज इक्वल टू टू एक्स स्क्वेड प्लस वन प्लस माइनस स्क्वेर ऑफ दिस फोर एक्स स्क्वेड माइनस फोर एक्स प्लस वन विल बिकम टू एक्स माइनस वन होल स्क्वेड डिवाइडेड बाय टू नेक्स्ट फोर इज इक्वल टू टू एक्स स्क्वेड प्लस वन प्लस और माइनस दिस स्क्वेयर विल बी कैंसल आउट विद दिस स्क्वेयर रूट एंड हेयर वी आर लेफ्ट विद टू टाइम एक्स माइनस वन डिवाइडेड बाय टू नो फ्रॉम हेयर इधर फोर इज इक्वल टू टू एक्स स्क्वेड प्लस वन प्लस टू एक्स माइनस वन डिवाइडेड बाय टू और फोर इज इक्वल टू टू एक्स स्क्वेड प्लस वन माइनस टू एक्स माइनस वन डिवाइडेड बाय टू From this equation, this negative one will be cancelled out with this positive one, and this will become four is equal to two x squared plus two times x divided by two. Next, four is equal to from the numerator we can factor out two. Two as common factor in bracket left x squared plus x divided by two. Now these two will be cancelled out with these two, and here we are left with four is equal to x squared plus x. We move this four to the right hand side, then this will become x squared plus x minus four is equal to zero. And by solving this quadratic equation, we get x is equal to negative one. Plus minus root seventeen divided by two. Now, from this equation, four is equal to two x squared plus one negative times two x negative two x negative times negative one plus one divided by two. Next, four is equal to two x squared minus two times x. This one plus this one will become plus two divided by two. Next, four is equal to from the numerator we can factor out two. Two as common factor in bracket left x squared minus x plus One divided by two. Now this two will be cancelled out with this two, and we get four is equal to x squared minus x plus one. We move this four to the right hand side, then this will become x squared 
minus x plus uh, 1 minus 4 is equal to 0. And this will become x squared minus x plus 1 minus 4 minus 3 is equal to 0 and by solving this equation we get the value of x is equal to 1 plus minus root 13 over 2. So, from this equation we get two values of x, x 1 is equal to negative 1 plus root 17 over 2 and x 2 is equal to negative 1 minus root 17 over 2 and from this equation we get the third value of x, x 3 is equal to 1 plus root 13 over 2 and x 4 is equal to 1 minus root 13 over 2. Now, let us verify these values of x and see that which of them are solution. To verify, we use the domain of the equation. First condition is x must be less than or equal to 4. And the second is x squared must be less than or equal to 4. As a domain of the equation we have x must be less than or equal to 4 and x squared must be less than or equal to 4. First we check this value negative 1 plus root 17 over 2. So, this uh, negative 1 plus root 17 over 2 is less than 4. So, this condition is true. Now, square of this value negative 1 plus uh, root uh, 17 over 2 squared is it less than or equal to 4? This uh, negative 1 plus root 17 can be written as uh, root 17 minus 1 divided by 2 squared is it less than or equal to 4. Now, this uh, root 17 minus 1 whole squared will become root 17 squared minus uh, 2 times root 17 plus uh, 1 squared divided by square of this 2 is 4. Is it less than or equal to 4? Now, this square will be considered with this square root and 17 plus 1 will become 18 minus 2 times root 17 divided by 4. Is it less than or equal to 4? If we multiply both sides by 4, this implies that 18 minus 2 times root 17. Is it less than or equal to 16. In this 18 minus 2 times root 17, 18 minus 2 times root 17 is less than 16. So, this condition is true. This value of x 1 negative 1 plus root 17 over 2 is a valid solution. Now, let us verify this second value of x negative 1 minus root 17 over 2. This is negative 1 minus root 17 over 2 is less than 4. So, this condition is true. Now, square of this value negative 1 minus root 17 over 2 whole squared is it less than or equal to 4? Now, this negative 1 minus root 17 whole squared will become negative 1 squared minus 2 times negative 1 times root 17 plus root 17 squared divided by 
square of these two is 4. Is it less than or equal to 4? Now, square of negative 1 is 1. Negative 2 times negative 1 will become plus 2 times root 17. Plus, this square will be cancelled out with this square root and here we get 17 divided by 4. Is it less than or equal to 4? Now, this 1 plus 17 will become 18 plus 2 times root 17 and if we multiply both sides by 4 this will become is it less than or equal to 16 and this 18 plus 2 times root 17 is greater than 16 so this condition is false It means that this value of x to negative 1 minus root 17 over 2 is not a solution. And in the same way, if we verify this value, this value will be rejected. And this value 1 minus root 13 over 2 is a valid solution. So, we have two solutions of this equation.